TRS-1 is a very sophisticated and intelligent device. Basically what it does is it takes pieces of information and what we call is we put them into packets. Think of little packages or envelopes like the mail system and within that information we can carry all sorts of types of data. So it could be voice, it could be uh, video, it could be just general information like email. And what it does is it moves them around at very, very high speeds across very large, long distances. Typically, these types of devices would be deployed by the very large uh, carriers or cable companies. So the Time Warner Cables, the Comcast, AT&T, uh, or Verizon, as an example, in the US. C CRS-1 uh, was really conceived actually um, around the boom of the dot-com era. Um, it was when we in the company and some of us in particular in the management team had a vision of an all IP network and John in particular believed that we'd be able to transform all types of data and move them around over, over IP, over the internet that was just starting to grow. So when we got together, uh, we spent a little bit of time thinking about the concepts of what this would look like and key to that was the size and the scale. Now at the time the internet was growing about 10 times a year. It was really on a dramatic pace, but of a very small base. So first thing we had to think about was how do we get together and think about the scale aspects, and more importantly, what types of traffic would move across it. If you think back then, video was a very, very small piece of uh, the percentage of the overall internet traffic, maybe less than 1% to 2%. Today, as many of you know, it's rapidly approaching 80, maybe 85% of all the traffic. So we had to kind of think about how far it would scale. I think the other things I would say about the beginnings of the project when we started it, uh, we really took the top folks within the company. I think only a company like Cisco could really build this. You had to have the knowledge and the foundation of what had been built before. So a great set of people came together. We spent the first 90 days putting the concept together and then we were up and running and we just needed John to back us in terms of the funding.